Hola, mi nombre es Elisa Cortés Bravo, soy de Nombrero, Tamaulipas y actualmente vivo en Playa del Carmen. Hi, my name is Elisa Cortés. I am from Nuevo Laredo, Tamaulipas, but actually I live on Playa del Carmen now. I'm from Nuevo Laredo, Tamaulipas. Well, I grew up there, but I was born in a small town in Puebla. It's called Chignahuapan, Puebla. My parents were living there at the time. So when I was two years old, my parents decided to move to Tamaulipas. So that's where I grew up all my life. My parents uh, currently live, still live in Nuevo Laredo, Tamaulipas, uh, but me and my younger brother lives in Playa right now, and my oldest brother lives in Barcelona, Spain. In Northern Mexico, my, my dad is an anesthesiologist. My mom is the family doctor. <laughs> That's how you say it in English. And the brother that, that lives in Nuevo Laredo has just opened a month ago an Italian restaurant in Nuevo Laredo called Giardino, if somebody goes there. I moved to South Mexico. Um, I was already thinking to move to another city. I'm one kind of one of those persons that like change and on their life. So I was thinking to maybe move to another country, but one holiday, one holiday we came to Riviera Maya and Merida and all this area. And I honestly fell in love with the area. I fell in love with the nature, with the simple life, uh, with the people, with the food, with the culture. There's a lot, a lot more like Mexican culture kind of thing. Uh, the Mayan culture, I love history. So yeah, that's what like, would draw me more to the South Mexico. Um, I have traveled to, I, I, I feel I have been a very good traveler, as I can say. I have traveled to other countries. Uh, two years ago, I did a trip with my mom to Europe like a mom-daughter trip. Uh, uh, it was a month, month, um, month long trip. So yeah, I had a great time. I, I lived in Paris for a short period of time and I love, I loved uh, living in another country that is very different from Mexico, weather, people, everything. And I loved it. I love to meet uh, new cultures, as you can say. Uh, yeah, I love that all the diversity of other cultures. Okay. Oh, my English is very good because uh, since I was very little, my parents um, uh, put me in a bilingual school. So since I was six, six years old, I've been learning English. Um, after I was very shy to talk English because, well, in my family, we don't talk English. We, we just talk Spanish. My parents don't talk English. My brothers, some some so when we traveled to the US that's when we tried to talk in English but uh, I was very embarrassed to talk English but after traveling to other countries and meeting new people that actually talk English I become braver and well with my boyfriend Paris right now I talk English every day and I loved it actually I'm a graphic designer I have loved this profession since I was little. Since I was five years old, I was very creative. I, I used to draw and paint and color in all the books. In the school, everybody knew me like the girl that they can go and ask for drawings and for paints. So the teacher told me, you're going to be a very good graphic designer. At that age, I didn't know what was a graphic designer, but I just grew up knowing that I was gonna be a designer. So yeah, when I when my the college come came up, I moved to Monterey and I went to university four years for graphic design career and publicity. And I honestly, I honestly love my career. It's very yeah, I can be very very creative. Very um, I can give fresh new ideas. Um. Yeah, I really love it. To someone that has never visited Mexico, I would say to, to have a very open mind. 
when you go to another country, you need to be that way to really suck up all the culture as much as you can. Try just to watch everything, everything of the local people do and just try to copy it, what they do. But yeah, just come with a very open mind. You're gonna, you're gonna meet new culture, new people, new traditions what they do in their um, day-to-day life um, and yeah just try to uh, enjoy this uh, sunny weather in Mexico and uh, try to meet the very very nice people Mexicans and I think you're gonna enjoy it so much I think I like the most the diversity of my country the people the nature the culture uh, the animals, the plants, the food, the, the clothing, every state has their own cultural um, food, uh, clothing, how they talk, how they express, what they do. So every state, it's kind, it's for me, it's kind of another different country. And that's what I love about my country. And I invite you guys to come and visit Mexico with with a very open mind like I said just enjoy uh, this country that will give you a very warm welcome so in Cabin Condos I work as a graphic designer I come up with some from the logo I, I help Parrish and Mike to do all the brand and image and I come up with a, a lot of ads a lot of the brochure a lot of ideas um, for, for them to grow like this brand for you guys. Um, and yeah, that's what I do actually. If you see some ads, uh, very cool ads on the page or Facebook or social media, I am the one that does that. Thank you for joining me on this kind of talks with me. I hope you like what I talk about my life and my life in Mexico. And I hope you visit my beautiful country one time. Thank you and have a nice day. Muchas gracias por haberme escuchado en este video, espero que les guste y los espero en el próximo Cabin Talks. Gracias y adiós.